Um, my name is Tony Beltran. I'm the Executive Director of the Lake County Health Department and Community Health Center. And we're located just north of Chicago. We're the county north in between Chicago and Wisconsin. So we've had an EMR for a while, but before we had our population health system, it was really challenging. We wanted to produce reports, so kind of the way I think of it is a continuum of how we did that. I asked one of our providers um, about her diabetic patients, and she pulled a piece of paper off the wall and said, these are the people I'm worried about. There was probably about 20 patients on that list, and I said, what about the others, right? Where are they? And so we actually moved to um, using our electronic health record, and within that we developed our diabetes report. It took us about nine months. I thought it would take about a month. Um, it took nine months to get the data, but it was pretty static and, and challenging. Um, but I realized if we were going to actually have to do that for all the chronic disease, we couldn't use nine months. So that's when we actually were um, thinking, we're struggling so much with this, we need a patient registry that will really help us to um, jump forward um, dramatically on this. And so we were able to um, select eye to eye and we've been really happy with the product. So we're able to do a lot of things. We weren't really able to do um, patient huddles, you know, um, at the beginning of a day, partly because we didn't have that information. So all of our teams now are doing the patient huddles, which are great. But one of the interesting places where we're doing that is in our behavioral health location. So we have um, at one location about a thousand patients with serious mental illness. And we um, take our team as the psychiatrist, the psychiatric nurse, the therapist. All of those team members are the core of that team. And then we've added primary care into that. And that um, daily huddle is actually much different because we're thinking about the patient's mental health treatment plan. But we're also addressing the comorbidities of why our patients with um, mental illness died 20 to 25 years earlier. So we're thinking about diabetes, we're looking at cardiovascular disease, obesity, and smoking kind of as four of the areas that we focus on and creating that plan. And so having that interdisciplinary team discuss the patients that are coming in that day and what they're doing has been extremely useful for us and was not possible when we didn't have the data all collected in one location. I think there's a lot of advantages. One, it's pretty nimble as a system, so you're able to actually make changes. What we found is we have some super users that are really, that like the system, because unlike our um, EMR, they're actually able to do it without a lot of technical expertise. So we can get individuals with operational expertise that really know the day-to-day, -day, and they're the ones that are helping drive um, the process, versus in the past, it really felt like it was programmers deciding things for us. So I would definitely recommend eye-to-eye. -eye.